Hi, welcome to 10 Minute Movie Recap. Hope you are doing well and safe. Today, we are going to recap the movie, Snake, Fall of a City, a creature horror, which was released in 2020. The movie starts off in a desert, where a group of people are going on an expedition. They reach an abandoned factory, in the middle of the desert. They start researching around the area, and find that the soil there is not normal. When two of the group roam around the factory, an unknown creature sees them from a distance. While testing the soil, it is identified that rare minerals are found in the area. The head of the group sends their location's coordinates to their boss. He hears a scream from a distance, and runs there to see his other mates. The two go into a plant, and see a tank with boiling liquid. Scared by one of the mates, the girl drops the test tube, used to test the soil into the boiling liquid. A huge sandstorm approaches toward the factory, and the team decides to hide in a safe place. But along with the sandstorm, a gigantic snake comes to them and swallows one of the men. The remaining three run from the snake to pick up weapons and start shooting at it. Unharmed by the bullets, the snake eats the girl and leaves. The scene is then cut to show a car race in the desert. Lin the boy and Liang the girl race in their cars. Lin tries to woo Yang and chases her. Liang arrives at her camp, where she is staying with her friends Liao and Xiao. Liao catches a small snake and scares the two girls Xiao and Liang. Lin saves Liang when she falls down, and they get along. Liao comes to Liang and she notices that Liao's hands are covered with black blood. He says that he didn't know the snake had black blood, and he had to kill the snake as it was going to hurt him. Liang asks Liao's help to refuel her car, and they leave the place. The movie then switches to a city, where a man Xiang is shown as a director of the company. He is the one who sent the team to discover the rare minerals in the desert. He is informed by one of his employees that they got a signal from the expedition team, and they have found the place they have been searching for. Xiang feels happy on hearing this, he goes to meet director Xiao, who had invested a lot of money in this initiative, and is angry with Xiang for no development. She is on the verge of breaking her contract to get back her money. Xiang tells her that a team he had sent discovered the place, and will get a satisfactory answer to all her questions soon. In the meantime, the remaining two from the expedition team, who are stranded in the desert sandstorm, find an underground facility, gets into that to hide from the storm and the snake. They see that the underground facility is a lab, which holds a lot of eggs in a huge container. Xiang goes to a hospital to meet Zhang, who is the owner of the abandoned factory in the desert. Sitting by his son, taking care of him, Zhang meets up with Xiang. Xiang rudely asks Zhang to sell his factory. Zhang politely refuses the deal, saying that the factory and the land has sentimental values to him. Xiang threatens to kill Jiang's son if he doesn't say okay for the deal. No way left, Zhang agrees to the deal and signs it. In the desert, Liang and Lin start off on their next trip. Lin proposes to Liang and they seem to have a past, and already broke up. Liang is unhappy about Lin, because he left her when she needed it the most. Failing with his attempt, Lin leaves the place to have dinner. A mysterious creature watches them from a distance. Back in the factory, the expedition team comes in contact with the snake again, and one man sacrifices his life to save the last remaining, and gets eaten by the snake. The next morning, in the camp, Lin wakes up in the car and hears that a monstrous snake killed Liao, and destroyed the whole place leaving Xiao and Lin's friend alive. Liang had already left the place in her car to the factory. So, Lin, his friend and Xiao leave the place, in search of Liang to the factory. Arriving at the factory, they spread out, and search for Liang only to find her bag. Xiang, Xiao and Zhang arrive at the factory along with their men, and meet up with Lin. Lin tells Xiang that, there is a monster snake out there and the place is not safe. Xiang disagrees and they both get into a fight. The snake comes out of the factory, and kills one of Xiang's henchmen, it starts chasing the others. The people scatters around, and hide in different places of the factory. Lin meets up with Liang, Xiao hides in a car and Lin's friend hides with Xiang and his men. Happy to see Liang, Lin asks why she came there. Deviating him from the question, Liang says that they have to look for options to escape. She says that the snake seems to be a sand boa. It tends to hide underground, and has poor eyesight. But she can't understand why it turned into a monstrous one. Zhang, who now hides with Xiang, opens up after Xiang threatens him, that he is a biologist, and he was doing some research in the factory some years back and he is not sure about why the snake turned into a gigantic one. Xiao, who is hiding in the car, sees that the boa goes past her, and couldn't notice her. Xiang and Xiao, along with the entire team, move to the second floor of the factory as it's safer. Liang goes out of her hiding place to save Xiao, and Lin follows her. The three of them get into the car and leave, 
They bump into a mysterious man, but still manages to leave. They reach the place where Xiang's team is hiding to rescue Liang's friend. After lots of argument, Xiang orders his men to open the door, only to trap others inside, and gets the car key and escapes. But the mysterious man scares him, and sends Xiang again inside. The boa doesn't seem to hurt the mysterious man. The last remaining man from the expedition team tries to escape from the snake, but a liquid falls onto him and he faints. Xiang and Zhang hear this sound and go down to check on it, and find the minerals Xiang was looking for along with a gun. Xiang threatens Lin with the gun, and orders him to get the cars near him. But Liang and Lin's friend agrees to go out instead of Lin, and leave the factory with ropes tied to their waist, connected to the factory. After some time, Liang alone returns back and it's presumed, Lin's friend is dead. In all this calamity, one of Xiao's henchmen is bitten by the boa. He seems to be getting serious with the wound. Xiang and Xiao try to kill the man to avoid getting infected. But Liang is determined to save him, and tries to go outside. Lin also agrees to go with her and they leave. Liang says to Lin that she came to the factory in search of her father, who was lost there 15 years ago. Lin proposes to Liang again, and assures her he'll be there for her. They both get back to the factory with the medicine, but while getting in, the boa also gets in chasing people. Except Lin, everybody moves to the second floor, and he is trapped with the snake. Xiang tries to operate a crane, to drop a heavy metal object onto the boa. Lin distracts the boa, and gets it in the spot. Xiang drops the metal object, and kills the boa. Everybody rejoices in happiness. It is shown that the snake in the underground lab is a different one, and is waiting near the fainted man. He wakes up, but the snake cannot sense him anymore, and leaves. Xiang and Lin get into a fight over who leaves the place with the car. But the sandstorm approaches again along with another boa in it, and it swallows Xiao. The infected henchman saves Lin and Liang by pushing, and locking them inside the factory. Xiang and Zhang leave for the lab, and there they see the eggs in the container. Ling and Liang also arrive there. Zhang reveals that he was doing research to invent a drug, to cure his dying son. The invented drug mutated the sand boas, and made them excrete metal-like substances from their body and there are no rare minerals there. Liang find a watch near the container that belonged to her father, and she identifies that the mysterious man is her father. He hurts Xiang, and Xiang leaves the place. The boa comes again to attack them. But Liang's father goes in the front, stunning the boa. Zhang tries to blow up the egg container with the gun, but the snake eats him. Liang's father then picks up the gun, asks Lin, and Liang to leave and shoots at the container. The container explodes, killing the boa and Liang's father. Lin and Liang get in their car to leave. Xiang begs them to save him too. All three start to leave the place as the entire place blasts, unearthing more boas. Xiang saves Lin and Liang, and gets eaten. Liang leaves the place in the car leaving Lin behind. Another boa chases Liang's car among all explosions, and one explosion kills it. Lin arrives in another car, hands over the key to Liang and faints. Lin is then shown in hospital reuniting with Liang. 